Good morning, Paul and Drigo here, Toronto Real Estate Unfiltered. Um, today is it going to be a different sort of episode, uh, not going to be as much real estate information or um, any of that kind of stuff. Today is going to be about building longer tables. Now, something that I've done throughout the years, and, and I'm very happy about um, all the efforts that I've put into this and uh, of course uh, all the help that I've gotten from uh, so many people over the years about helping build longer tables. So when you have you know when you have any degree of success in life whether it be in your job or whether it be uh, in, via your investments whatever whatever degree of success you've reached in your life that uh, uh, again that uh, I know many of you have again worked very hard for I know I have. Um, that's when you build longer tables. So that's when you, again, try to do something more for those who need it. So I've always said with, with goals, especially, a goal is a wish that you say out loud. It becomes real. When you say it out loud, you become accountable. Um, many of the people that I consider my coaches, and they might not know that they are, but there's a lot of people that I hang around and, and that I, that I um, spend time with, I would call um, my coaches in the sense that they are the kind of people that do this on a very high level. So my goal in December 2018 is to feed as many of the hungry and the homeless as those of you who have helped me feed and take care of my family. Every single time I am able to help one of you buy or sell or rent um, any of those things, um, a referral that you've sent my way. I am incredibly grateful for each and every one that you send my way. Uh, and I don't forget it. I'm, um, you know, I'm a, I'm a, I've got a family. I've got two kids. Uh, I'm the primary uh, caregiver for my, for my wife as well. She's legally blind. Um, so there's a lot of there's a lot of hard work involved in making sure that uh, things are um, taken care of in my family. And, and that's something that uh, I know I cannot do alone. And, and, and I don't because um, whether it's those of you listening or those of you who are telling your friends to friends, family, co-workers to um, work with me, it's, uh, it's, it's always, uh, again, an extreme um, you know, I'm extremely grateful each time. And, and, and that will never change no matter how long I do this. So here is my goal. Um, it's based on the fact that it costs approximately $4 to provide a meal at the Scott Mission. So my target is for the next 121 Toronto and greater Toronto area could be anywhere from um, all the areas that I service, which could be Oakville, uh, Richmond Hill, Whitby, Etobicoke, Oshawa, Pickering, any of the any of the GTA area, anything within about an hour of Toronto is 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 where I serve. So any of those areas that have uh, filled out a property evaluation at mysoldreport.com um, in the month of December, I will donate one dollar to the Scott Mission. Just for filling it out, of course, the address has to be real, not one two three anywhere street. Um, those don't ever count. So if it's a, a real address with a real property owner, and of course, uh, those are the only uh, ones that I will count, um, each one I will donate $1 uh, to the Scott Mission. So for the first or for the next 121 of them that I get, um, and then for each sold, each property bought or sold in the month of December, I will also donate an additional $121. Uh, and the reason I'm using that number is because it equates to approximately 30 meals provided. Uh, and each year, my goal is to help uh, between 50 to 100 clients each year. I think this year it's going to be around between 30 and 40 that I've been able, been able to help. And I'm very, again, very grateful for that. So 35 or 36 clients a year um, for me is a very uh, healthy number. And it basically just... Um, uh, it's something that, again, I'm, I'm happy to, uh, again, continue and, of course, continue working on some years. There's more, some years, there's less. Um, again, uh, I count relationships in my business, not transactions. So the relationships that I've created this year, um, of course, there are going to be more next year of different kinds, and, and, I, and I welcome those. So 
Thank you for listening today. Hopefully this one won't be one of the longer messages, um, but it's definitely something where um, I need your help. So please uh, tell your friends, tell your family and yourselves who are thinking about making a move. Start off at mysoldreport.com. What it explains to you there um, is the importance of my five-star client experience. Um, it's not enough. And, and again, you definitely deserve more than just, uh, you know, the, the very basic elements. And, and I see uh, so often in, in, in my, you know, my daily updates on, on the screen, I see so often there are properties being sold and, and, and listed uh, that are nowhere near being uh, marketed well enough and, and, and to the extreme that, um, that, that, that I try to do. So understand that I do need you to connect with me to make sure that, again, it's being done correctly. Who you choose at the end of the day, of course, this comes down to relationships on your end too. Who you feel the most comfortable with is who you end up with. Um, The sold prices are what they are. Uh, No one has any sort of um, added benefit. No one can get in there and promise you something more than what has actually sold in your area. Uh, If they do, then you're probably being bought. And what I mean by that is if someone's buying your listing, they're giving you a price that, again, is not likely um, to get the listing signed. And that's something that, again, I would uh, rather not do. I have a three-phase pricing strategy that I use. Uh, and generally speaking, for most people, they choose the, uh, the number that is the one that works for them that will actually get the property sold. Um, and, and sometimes it takes a little while to get there, which is why it's important for us to start early. So thanks for tuning in today. Visit mysoldreport.com and help me build longer tables. Uh, Not just in December. I I try to do these kind of things throughout the year, different kinds. Uh, But this is what I'm focused on right now. uh, And I would love your help. Thank you very much.